Hey folks, as you can see by the uh, familiar white envelope that I have received another package from my good buddy in Germany, uh, CR62 Silver and more. And as usual, it came extremely well packaged, he always does, uh, with the uh, traditional cardboard. And this stuff is more like hardboard than cardboard, but uh, it sure protects the coins and you can see there's the handwritten note that says, thanks, Mike, exclamation mark. Stay safe, brother, Christian. And uh, Christian, you do the same, my friend. And if you give me a few minutes now, or no, see, I'm stumbling already. Okay, we're going to remove the packaging, and you can see the, the uh, familiar Dr. G coin stand with my medals mafia puck poured by none other than silver vessel, my gorgeous bear, Jolly Roger Red Eye, and my two scoops, my two Scully, uh, uh, my two Scully Red Eye, uh, Red Eyes, my two Scully Jolly Rogers up here, one in ten carat, and one in nine nine nine, and you can see the ugly old guy behind you talking in the camera there or in front of you, but anyway, give me a second here and we'll uh, commence looking at some coins. All right, folks, the first couple of coins we're going to look at here are a couple of uh, beautiful Canadian commemorative coins. And these are non-circulating commemorative coins. They have a, a $20 face value. Each of these beauties is made out of 925 silver and there's 33.6 grams of 925 silver works out to 10 ZT of uh, pure silver and there any scratches you see are definitely on the capsule cuz these are just beauties and these will get put away in deep deep storage anyway but they're just gorgeous these things look at the I got a bunch of them now and they're uh, they're highly reflective just beautiful coins Christian thank you very much my friend all right folks these next two coins you're looking at here are a pair of Belgian beauties and uh, I know it might look a little bit like 1945 but it's definitely 1949 there you go you can see and uh, these are 50 francs from Belgium you can see right here it says uh, Belgique which is French for Belgium <laughs> and uh, 50 francs down here and these beauties are 83.5 percent silver and uh, they're just lovely coins, Christian. I like them. But anyway, we're going to pause this and uh, grab a couple oh, Okay, more. here we go. You might think I'm trying a little trickery here, but I'm not. Because this one is definitely 1950. And uh, again, these are made out of 83.5% silver. They're uh, 1950, both of them. 50 francs from Belgium. And these ones, it's, you can see here it says Belgie. These are the Dutch text. They're written in, uh, they have coinage in French and in Dutch. So there's uh, a couple more real beauties, Christian. Thank you very much, buddy. All right, here we go. The next coin we have uh, up for your uh, viewing pleasure, I guess, is the beautiful 200 Zlotych from uh, Poland. And these, these are made out of 62.5% uh, silver. And uh, I have four of these beauties, and this, uh, believe it or not, is the ugliest one. <laughs> so I thought I'd just show that. But they're just beautiful coins, and they're uh, a commemorative coin, and they're to uh, commemorate the 30th anniversary of the People's Republic of Poland. Um, it's, I don't know, it was some kind of anniversary. They got rid of uh, fascism or something like that, I believe in uh, 1949 or something I don't know but uh, they're beautiful coins and like I don't know if I said but he sent me four of these and they're um, like this is the worst of the bunch and this is a beautiful condition coin so uh, once again Christian thank you very much buddy Here we go the uh, the last two coins that he sent me are a pair of uh, Australian shillings and one from 1954 and one from 1958 and uh, they may look identical but there is one small difference if we uh, turn them around here yeah, get that one and flip her around now you'll notice I'll get my little pointer here um, 
this coin right here, Regina dot F D plus Elizabeth. And this one is Regina plus Elizabeth. So they call this one with FD and they call this one without FD and uh, something to do with God, I believe. So there was some politics involved there. You can bet on that one. But anyway, Christian, once again, you've uh, sent me a beautiful bunch of coins. I hope you're happy with mine. And uh, YouTube, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>